Good day, everybody. Well, got another project going on today. Show you what I'm getting into. I'm uh, taking this attachment off here that came with the bucket or came with the loader. And I'm going to go to a quick connect, which is right here. So I have to take this off, take the bolts out of here, pull those pins out on both sides. And then I'm going to put this on. As you can see, I got to turn it around. And then this is the uh, new quick connect I got. And then I've got the, uh, um, basically the bracket here that will go on the back of the bucket. So I'm going to do this in two stages. It's going to take a little bit to get that on the bucket. And I'm going to have a friend of mine stop by tomorrow and help me get that so I can tack it on there. But uh, so I can get it all straight and level and everything. So we'll get all set up here and we'll get those... Uh, Get that old bracket off of there and we'll put a new one on and see how it goes. So stay tuned. One pin I had a hard time getting out it had too much paint on it I don't know whether they painted it after they got it in the slots or not but I had to take it to the grinding wheel and um, spin it through the through the uh, grinding wheel use the fine grid on it and it took all that paint off and it seems to uh, slide in there much better so let's see
there's that. So I gotta go to the hardware and get me some bolts, better bolts than what were in there. I'd like to put new bolts in if I'm gonna put on a new piece of equipment and uh, see how this works. Uh, when you hook this up to your bracket on the bucket, then all you do is push these down and this locks those pins into the bottom of that. All right, we got her on there now. And um, let me show you how this thing's supposed to work. Uh, I've got the plate up here that's gonna go on the back of that bucket. Now that has to be welded on. I'm not gonna be doing that today. But let me start the tractor up and tilt this and I'll give you an idea of how this thing is supposed to work. For those of you that uh, aren't familiar with it. So hold on. So that's how it works. It basically will lock that bucket right here onto this with those uh, levers right there. Locks that thing right down. But uh, anyway, um, I want to give a shout out to uh, AshTractorMike.com. He uh, he has a website that I ordered this through, and I got in touch with him after about two and a half weeks after I ordered it. I uh, hadn't heard anything as to where it was. He checked, and the manufacturer he uses, their whole emphasis had changed to uh, building uh, grapple buckets uh, for a while. So they took all their um, production off of making these uh, quick connect hitches and went to grapple buckets. So he and I talked, and uh, it turns out that he was able to uh, put, well, I, I checked on another manufacturer, and he said yeah he could order through that manufacturer so he ordered through this manufacturer uh, on uh, last I think it was last Friday and I got this in yesterday so want to put a shout out to him if you have any questions uh, about different things that uh, he does he's on ashtractormike.com he's out in Missouri so um, but he has a website you can order different things off of it for compact uh, tractors or any other type of tractors uh, like I say I got this through him uh, through his uh, website that he uh, ordered it from another company so anyway that's how this thing all puts together and how it works um, if you have any questions uh, be sure and uh, comment on the comment section of the video um, and let's get out and do something appreciate all your subscribers